All right, so everybody else has already woken up. I was the one who like slept until noon. Felt sweet though. Honestly, I'm just gonna take that as maybe you're extra well rested for the lift. So I get the scraps, but this is just perfect. I'm thinking, there's not a scale, but you can kind of guess what like a half inch pound, you know, three eighth pounds of beef looked like. So I think I'm just have a bowl of that combined with uh, whatever else I can scrounge around for. But today I haven't eaten a ton of carbs, which even intra workout or like right before, I do kind of feel a difference energy wise. So I've got about 100 grams of cluster dextrin just mixed in with the water, unflavored. So a scoop and a half of the foundation combined with a little bit of the bloodshot, that will do me good. So I'd say after we take this, maybe, eh. Since we're already at the gym, usually I take this on the drive or before I even get in the car. But So by the time I actually get in, it's you know, doing its thing. But we'll probably just take a little bit of a little bit of extra time, warm up, get our shoulders going, tries, chest, just so we feel fresh. And then you know, 20 minutes from now, maybe 30 minutes from now, we'll actually be on our first working sets, you know, wherever that ends up being. Because this place is fully stocked with everything you can imagine. never understood sipping on a pre-workout throughout the whole lift and I see it a lot it's like or if somebody well if you're sipping on a bang or something like that when you actually took your pre before then I guess I could get that you kind of have a constant flow of caffeine but you got to remember the whole point of the pre-workout I mean just look at the name it's pre not intro workout right? you got to take it first so you can actually feel the effects gulp of this fast forward 20 minutes and then I'm sure we'll be throwing some hectic steel around for a new shaker company because right now we're doing uh, blender bottles but we've got about like fucking six ounces fully dosed I'm like I need six ounces no probably not you want them yeah, for real? Yeah, for sure don't make them gross I'm not, I'm not gonna make them I haven't fucking worn them yet yeah these are sweet Special treatment. Were the headphones? Yeah. I hooked them up. I saved the workout for them. I don't know if I'd be able to have a, as good of a workout without these. Do you always, do you always train with headphones? Yeah. If I was in a. Yeah. If I get the choice between a, like no sound, no music, yeah, or anything, same way. 
I'd, I'd rather have mine. Like it's. It's. It, I've. I've been in a situation where I have to drive back home to get my headphones. I've, That's how much I'd rather have music. I've done it before, but it wasn't really a drive. Because whenever I'm doing my little lift, yeah. my drive to the gym is like five minutes long. So I just do a loop. It goes circles. I'm doing a little loop. So if I forget something, I'm like, oh, all right, I'm literally, You're already there. I'm yeah. literally here. Thank you, Mr. Bennett. But yeah, I, I definitely prefer it. Sam's making my earphones disgusting. I have never worn them um, I'm gonna train my. I'm gonna train separate. You. What uh, <laughs> Ben? What do you want to start with? You think for pressing? Once we get into it, I've kind of been doing a lot of barbell, so I, I wouldn't mind a machine press. Yeah, let's try one of those. Uh, one of the prime presses with the independent. We can change some of the loading on it, but not not be too crazy with it. Yeah, maybe I'll chest. That's usually what I do. Okay. Cool movements. It's like a crane. I mean, everything is sweet. What do you think? What develops the more hardcore lifter? A gym that has everything you could ever ask for at your disposal, and it's nice and clean and cool with sweet lighting, like it is here? Or like a basement, rusty squat rack? like. 50 pound plates. It's hard to say. It's like a pampered rich kid versus a Dorian Yates style character. It's worth thinking about. But pre chest, this is where I take the most time warming up. Because, like, honestly, with back, I could just do like light pull downs, go a little heavier, a little heavier, a little heavier. And then the actual first, mov the first movement is the warm up. But for chest, if I don't get my tries going in my rear delt and my rotator cuff, then that's usually when I go heavy on pressing and have like a crunchy wrap my shoulders screwed for months. Not ideal. So proper warm up on chest, I'd say is, it's gotta be one of the most important. You don't wanna be a 40 year old dude saying you used to bench 315 and then now you're rocking 185. So just a cautionary uh, tale there. But you gotta remember, the whole point of the warm-up isn't to do any work. Like, I'm not exhausted after those. I'm just getting warmed up. So when I do the working sets, you know, I'm not gonna rip anything. Worst case scenario. This first part. This dumbbell rack is sweet. How's the chest injury? It's good. It's so good. Right. Good. Gone. Yeah. Didn't do I mean, good. I'm not gonna do four plates. Huh? I'm not gonna do four plates. So I think I'll do three. Yeah, but you're not feeling anything. I mean, like it's gone. Yeah, it's good. good. character, young, old, experienced, new. If your shoulders are feeling a little off or a little crunchy when you're doing bench, I guess mainly bench is where you hear this, but with this movement right here, even super lightweight, if you do this on a consistent basis, I can't, I mean, I'm not going to say with certainty, you can probably still hurt yourself, but more than likely, you're going to toughen up your rotator cuff and at least be less prone to you know, wrecking your ship. I think we're just about ready to start the actual lift. Don't worry about me. Gonna spot on the next time. That was wrong. 
Why are you the weights are there? This feels a little better than this. I'll go wide. By the way, I'll wear this because I have a back surgeon, so I'm just going to close this. Listen, I only fucking pull out. I don't mess with nobody else. I could hear your brain uh, trying to fucking bust my balls and shit. <laughs> Bro, listen, I have nothing to say right now. My fucking. This is where it's going to get embarrassing for me, chest. Right, yeah. I'm oh, sorry. I was going on the top one. To load the bottom as I meant. You get to load the bottom some more? Yeah, I mean, I'll, yeah, I think I'd, I'd probably put that in the middle for me. You might as well have done cardio. <coughs> Alright, let's take, take it all the way up. <coughs> okay, stay down, stay down, keep the shoulders thin. Come on, come on. Yeah, good. Keep your shoulders level. Drive through the chest. Drive through the chest. Come on, Pat. Yeah. Come on. Come on. Let's keep going. Yeah. Come on. Good. Come on again. We get two here, at least. Come on. Drive, drive, drive. Work, work, work. Good. Again. Take those feet in and go. Come on. Hard set. Press. Come on. Right here. Right here. There. Up. Up. Control it down. Control that down. Smooth. Okay. Put it down. Thank you. That's that always gives. That's kind of why I like incline bench. So my hat doesn't fall off. I gotta take it off when I lay down. You still warming up there? Yeah. Eh, this will be good. Yeah, this one goes, and then maybe just do two working sets here, then move on. All right, yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm good. I, I feel this a lot, so I'm good to get a few more extra sets out with it rather than just like two and done. Yep. Yeah, I can't wait. Well, two and done. 
If I'm feeling it. If I'm I don't want to do my setup nice. for what you. I'll stay with it. That's all I'm Come on, Pat, show me. Uh, nah, show nah, me. Nah. Show me. Come on. If you're going to talk, I'm going to do it. I'm not going to talk. I just want to see. I want to see if you've progressed since the last time we trained. It did, I did it. I, like that. I haven't, my chest hasn't progressed in strength in 15 on, years. It's going to be fun. Pat, stop making fucking excuses. Let's go. Oh. Come on, Pat. Come on. You got this. Good. Oh, yeah. Come on. There you go, there you go, there you go. Come on, Come on now. Come on now. Come on, Here. Strong. Good. I'm going to keep that going. You go. Come on, let's work. Come on. Good. Come on. Go again. In that left. In that left. All the way through. Here. Right here. Good. Again. Go again. Shoot. Come on, mate. Yup. Yup. Good. Go again. Go again. Everything. Everything. Here. Take the weight. Take the weight. It's slow. Come on. Good. You're a fucking liar. Ben did like six minutes rest. Here we go. Fucking awesome. Here we go. <laughs> don't touch me. Don't touch me. Hey, <laughs> why are you taking reps off me? I did like at least seven. <laughs> Fuck off, yeah. You're next, right? Huh? Are you going next? Or am I next? You went next. Yes, yeah. Continue. Yeah, four in the middle. Four in the middle. <laughs> Sweet. Easy work, Sam. There you go, strong. Dig those feet in. Give yourself a base. There you go. Give yourself a base. Come on, strong. Yeah. Easy work. Come on. Come on. You stay level. I'll keep you moving. Let's go. Come on, mate. Let's go. Let's go. Right there. Right there. Right there. Let's go. Control that. Give me one. Come on. Go. Yo. Go. Right here. Right here. Right here. Right here. Come on. Yeah. Yep. Oh, yeah, that was good. <laughs> oh my god. Whew. All right, I've had enough there. Here, grab the Bronx off the kitten. Whew. There you go. Yeah. Yeah, make sure your feet kind of float. Yeah. Take them in. Kind of give you a better base. Lifting that and Sam. I know, I know. That's what that means. That's how strong I am. Yeah, I'm alright to move on. We've all done, yeah, we've all done two now. Yeah. What That's are you like next? Another one of these machines? Yeah. That one looks kind of cool. This? This works now. It's nice. The awesome one works now. It's, it's, it's a little tough to get into though. Yeah. For when you're wide. Oh, we can do this. You have to put the blocks on top too. Um, yeah, put, put two plates on and try it. Yeah. Yeah, two or three plates is actually plenty. Yeah. That motherfucker's heavy. You want to see if that's low enough for you, Sam? Yeah. Let's uh, yeah, see how she feels, sweet. Oh, yeah. Definitely narrow grip. You want to say that's C2? Oh, so you can go. You want to start with two? I'll stay there. Cool. Yeah, let me see how it goes. Yeah, I got it. Pat, I got it. You got it? Yeah, I got it. Come on. Come on, keep it up. Burn them out. Right, right, right. Oh. Come on, yeah. Go. Yeah, you're 
Come on, now. Come on. Yup, yup. Stay down, stay down, stay down. Drive through. Take the weight, take the weight. Control that. Use that weight, use that weight. Use that weight. Oh. Yeah, let's see how this feels. Should be a touch, Sam, right? Oh, what? You're not going to work here, right? Yeah, if well. No, nah, you go. Yeah, you got some more in you in this. I have to bump this seat down a notch so if you need it, yeah, move it back up. Okay. Yeah, three. Yeah. Is that where you go? Yeah, this will be a. Yeah. Yeah, okay, nice. this will be a good set. front delt. Yeah. Yes. It's more chest. You kind of almost yeah. under and in. Yeah. Yeah. yeah whereas there you just kind of roll over. You want to take your set down two and then I'll yeah. go? Yeah. 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 That's fine. Run it all the way. Same again. Yep. They're moving with me. Let's go. There, good. There are the reps. Good again. Come on. We need two here. Yep, yep. Get down. Good. And one with me. Come on, mate. I'm there. Good. Right to top. Right to top. Come on. Dig. 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 Yes. Control that. Control it. Shit. <sighs> <laughs> I said, do you think it'd be good to spot each side? Nah, it's always a disaster. Yeah. One person grabs and you're looking at this. Yeah. You want to spot them, sir? Yeah. Someone sit on my lap. Come on. <laughs> I showered this morning and everything. Okay, you're going I'm clean. I got you, bro. I'm sprayed. I've got my test there. I'm good. Slow down, Tiger. You won't get anything. Hey, this is like our third or fourth date. We're good. <laughs> it's time to go, right? If we don't bang, we're not getting a fifth. Oh. Bicep, shoulders, everything over here. I eat it all, so it's okay. Ooh. I'll take all the extra work. Yeah, what do you think? Two, two sets here? Two working sets, right? Yeah. 
Right, same again. Stay down, stay down. I could do a, some sort of heavy fly, heavy-ish fly. Yeah. I'm, I'm pretty sure press is gonna pull up elite right now. Yeah, I think we're, the press is good. Like I don't mind hitting maybe some like a heavy dip after. But maybe fly the chest out and then hit a dip and cool it. Yeah, I feel like I want to finish with flies. You want to hit a dip now then? Yeah, I'll do a little dip. That one? I feel like that one's real tricep bias. Oh, it depends how you sit on it. I mean, we haven't got another dip option, so it's yeah, kind of that or nothing, unless we hit this stacked uh, chest press for like a burnout into a fly. On a machine. Yeah, the prime and machine. The flies on the stack. Are you going to be able to stack it? Yeah, but no. We're, we're weak now. We're good. I'll do something. <laughs> we're weak. We're weak now. <laughs> well, yeah, what's, your, what's your other option? Honestly, I think usually I just finish with a bunch of flies and at the end of it. Let's do that. Like decline flies in sort of in front of the body. So I could kill you, like yeah. crossover? I, what I would usually do is maybe pec deck for like two. Yeah. And then flies, where it'd be like a, like a drop bridge. set. Like the hybrid stand. version? Yeah, maybe a low elbow reflection in there. I'm thinking really like flies first here. Yeah. Drop set and then down. Can you same thing? It. Yeah, that's cool. Yeah, so pec flies first and then pec deck. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. Some force stuff and then just pump on this. Yeah. There we go. Oh, hang on, they got that. Do you like that standing machine? Do you know you have nothing to do with this? I don't. I'll do that. Yeah. 
intra workout, it's all about fluid replenishment. Just, uh, just try not to put your whole mouth on that thing. I've seen it, I hate it. You guys are nuts. Yeah, this will be good. Yeah. I like this. It kind of flies just yeah. to get everything. I like this one, Gio. Like, something to rest my head on it. Like that? Yeah. And then I can, like, real dig. Yeah, that's, that's nice. It's smooth. Yeah, that's still smooth. Wait. Uh, Try doing 250. Uh, yeah, that might be too much. So. Yeah, can you do the 270? Oh. Yeah, that was heavy, right? Yeah. Okay. Well, it's about right. this machine before never and uh What's so up? when i say i don't love decline stuff it's not just for no reason because like oh i don't like the way it feels you know most people their lower tech it kind of gets hit the most doing any kind of dip or a push down really or a pullover anything your lower chest is going to come into play that's why most people even i mean even me upper chest is back here the lower chest is all the way down here <laughs> so i'm trying to put as much mass up here and get kind of a more of a look like that like a big ass upper chest shelf but with flying motions the stretch that i get on my whole chest it's worth getting some decline activation for sure so i think one more here and then we'll probably just finish with cables those four sets of pressing were a perfect starter you're gonna touch it like after the first one or two if it's too heavy I'll let you know and just put it down for me, but... Okay, okay, you got it, you got it. It might be... I don't think it's going to be too heavy, too light. I understand. I changed my mind. You're going up. It's too light, yeah. See that? Yeah. I was kind of feeling after my set, I'm like... What am I going to do? Yeah. You want to go to three? 270 or three? That's fine. That's good. I'll make it work. Come on. Squeeze it already. It's not a good way to spot on this bad boy. Yeah. See, that's it. Oh, yeah. This would then lend itself to a nice job. Show them the, the, the whole weight. Pad, right? yeah. I don't do that for nothing. It's for manly people. Now, that may be a little bit of an ego boost, but I actually do need a little more weight for this one. Do you think the new ones are the new ones on that side? And actually, that's not even the new one. There's one after that. That's the one on the new side. You can adjust it to these ones. No, no, that's just a lot of it. No, it's Oh, okay. Yeah. But, they just want to watch it. Yeah, I got to. 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 I got to.
Nice work, Sam. Come on, Sam, take it all the way. Take it all the way. Thank you. Good. Good, come on. Come on, come on. There, go. Give me one more. Good. That's good. All right, don't fall. Yeah, I think that's enough here. But that felt sweet. Our lifter dudes make fun of people for sitting down in between their sets or catching their breath. I do not know what they're talking about. I'll bring like a little exercise block with me to some movements just so I can fucking sit down and recover. But you know, whatever, you do you.
You already being strong on flies? Uh, Pretty much. I think so. What's your weak lift? What's your weak? Weak. Uh, I don't know if I have a really weak lift. Weakest of the <laughs> strong fucking lifts. Like rowing, pressing. I'm trying to just think. a good all rounder. I think it's all around pretty good. You're just fucking yeah, awesome all over. <laughs> <laughs> He's humble as well. He was actually humble because he made me force him to say that. Like even when I was like a 200 pounder, I was doing like 110s, dumbbell. That's like, a pound, pound yeah. Like. yeah, so not nothing. <sighs> That's a good set for me now if I put a couple of dumbbells. <laughs> I think when I did it now, I'd probably drop it backwards because I don't remember how to do it. <laughs> Yeah, I think that's good. That's good. You know what I do with like that? If I get really impartial, I end up using the wire. Yes, you're right, yeah. Like, yeah. yeah. I'm done. You want that light in that ring? You for sure want that light. Yes, <laughs> this will be good right here. The hard part is over. And now I just get to take off my, what do we say, thermal? Where's where I'd go? My thermal long john. long john and see what kind of nasty, diabolical, fear inducing. Imagine I said like 10 more words like that. Chest pump. Papa John's. Yeah. Before bed was. What, what are there? Eight slices of pizza in a pizza? Before bed was six. I slept like a baby though, so. Not necessarily advice. I'm just telling you what went down. <laughs> <laughs> Disclaimer. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, I'm fucking smoked. Shit.
sets of chests have now passed, four of them being heavy pressing, and the other four being not light, but you know, moderately light flies. So typically that's kind of how I like my lifts to look. I'd feel weird doing like pec flies before chest press, because I'd just be weak. You know, when you're strong, I think you do get benefit from pushing a lot of weight. But let's see how we look. What do you think? Pretty good, Sam. Yeah, that's a big man. Too fucking lean for an off season, though. Oh, I'm easing into it. <laughs> I've been easing into it for months. Come on. I've got to wrap that shit up. Yeah, you're, you look like you're six weeks out. I know, he does. Literally. Lift your chest up, open your back, yeah, that's better. Yes, that's pretty much it. That's getting a lot better, man, that looks good. Oh. All right, worked out, pumped, and now, what do you, what do you think we're going to eat? What do you think we're going to eat, burgers? Burgers or steak. That would be perfect. All right, so huge thanks for Performance Strength Academy. This gym, we got this sweet chest day in. <laughs> you know, I'm kind of jealous for anybody that lives around here because this is just straight up state of the art. I mean, I'll go to, I've got a couple of gyms in my rotation. You know, if you've seen all my lifts, I kind of go all over the place because I got to pick and choose. One gym might have this machine that I like, but if you got a membership here, you're pretty much set to get a freaky build, but we got to say thanks to Aries Nutrition and Patrick for bringing us out here because that's pretty much the reason why we even came over here and got to see this sick gym. And a lot of supplement companies we kind of see, or supplement stores, they're not really you know, bringing crews out like this. So just huge thanks to them. Uh,